Hey everybody, Pastor Stephen Anderson here from Faithful Word Baptist Church in Tempe, Arizona. This is just a really quick video about Dr. John Getch from West Coast Baptist College perverting the gospel and teaching works-based salvation over in Lancaster, California. This is, of course, Paul Chapel's right-hand man, and there's been all kinds of garbage coming out of this college for decades. It's been a horrible influence on independent fundamental Baptists. But I just want to focus on one thing in particular where Dr. John Getch is saying, well, you can't have your sin and salvation. You're going to have to turn from your sin in order to receive salvation. Folks, this is so stupid and ridiculous and how anyone who calls themselves a Baptist or a saved born again Christian can listen to this garbage is mind blowing to me. You can't have your sin and salvation. Well, what about your sin, John Getch? What about the sin that you have, John Getch, in your life? Because I guarantee, John Getch, that you sin every day, okay? The Bible says the thought of foolishness is sin. The Bible says to him that knoweth to do good and doeth it not to him it is sin. And you know what? I've heard John Getch get up and preach lying, compromising garbage to please the LGBT community. So isn't it amazing how his sin, he somehow gets a pass on it, but we can't have our sin and salvation. You must turn from your sin to be saved. This is the stupidest thing in the world because every single saved Christian is still capable of committing sin and does commit sin. Even the apostle Paul in Romans 7 talked about how he often did the things that he hated and he talked about in his epistles over and over again how the flesh warreth against the spirit, the spirit against the flesh. These are contrary the one to the other so that you cannot do the things that you would. O wretched man that I am, who shall deliver me from the body of this death? The disciple whom Jesus loved, the apostle John, who leaned on Jesus' breast at the Last Supper said, if we say that we have no sin, we deceive ourselves and the truth is not in us. John Getch, you're a sinner, John Getch. I'm a sinner. We all have sin. So to sit there and say, well, you can't have your sin and salvation. You're teaching work salvation, you fool. And I, you're not even a fool. You know what you're doing. You're a devil. You're a false prophet teaching people that to be saved, they have to turn over a new leaf, give up their sin, change the direction of their life. You know, you're going this direction and now you're gonna have to turn and go a totally different direction with your life. That is works-based salvation. That's as works-based as anything the Roman Catholic Church has ever taught. It is a lie. And just because you call it independent Baptist and try to dress it up and give lip service to salvation by faith, the Roman Catholic Church gives lip service to salvation by faith. Every false Christian denomination that teaches works will give lip service. Well, it's by faith, but you can't have your sin. You're going to have to give up your sin. Well, John Getch, just let us know once you've given up all your sin because you're condemning yourself to hell, John Getch, okay? Because you're going to stand before God one day, John Getch, and he's going to hold you accountable for the words out of your mouth. By thy words thou shalt be justified and by thy words thou shalt be condemned. And you know what he's going to say to you, John Getch? He's going to pull out these words where you said, well, you can't have your sin and salvation. That's what you said, John Getch. You lied to thousands of people when you told them, you can't have your sin and salvation. You got to turn from your sins. Well, then you know what? He's going to hold you to that standard, John Getch. You're going to be held to that standard. And then he's going to say, well, what about all these sins you have? Oh, well, uh, well, you said you can't have your sins on salvation. Well, you have all these sins. So you're damned. Go to hell, John Getch. I mean, think about it. He's teaching lies. He's teaching heresy. The Bible says that whosoever believeth in him should not perish but have eternal life. Salvation is by believing on Christ. Whoever believes in Christ is saved. He said, well, if you believe in Christ and call upon him for salvation, well, that's not salvation. That's just a prayer unless you actually, you know, change the direction of your life and you got to turn from your sins and you can't have your sin and salvation. Well, you can't have your sin and salvation, John Getch. You can't have your sin and salvation. And that's why you're going straight to hell, John Getch.